once again for visiting this channel as we continue our tutorial on DB2 On today's lesson, we're going to discuss Trinity Road in the live stream method. Work on road with a train, create previous name, and derive column from a column. Let us open our sample database. Connect to sample. Our discussion starts with limiting rows with the like clause. We use like clause to filter string patterns. On our problem, we're going to display the last name, first name, and the work department with last name that starts with letter S. To do that, we will have this script. Here is the result. Like filters string pattern. The percent symbol represents a wild card. Any letter, symbol, or number are included in the pattern regardless of its size. Let us assume if the requirement asks to filter surname with letter E as the second character of the surname. As you could see here, the underscore represents character of the data whatever the value is. The script tells us to display all last name that starts with any character that has a letter E preceding it. You still need to indicate the percent symbol to represent any character after E. We move now in limiting rows with dates. Our problem requires to list employees born between 1961 and 1971. Going to list the last name, first name, and the birth date. This would be our script. We have this result. The first condition we have set is to test if birth date is greater than or equal to the first day of 1961. The second condition is to test the last day of 1971. To test dates, we use the format uh, year, month, and day enclosed with single quotes. We could achieve the same thing with this script. We have removed the greater than and less than operators and simply replace it with between and clause. You may use also another approach. This time, we're going to use a year function. As you could see with our previous examples, we could make multiple approaches in addressing a requirement. Let's move on in creating column with an alias name. You may use another column title for a specific column if we do not like to use the column name defined in the structure of the table. We include as to identify the alternative name for the column enclosed with double quotations. Drop as if you want and write immediately the alias name, still and close with double quotation marks. Other than specified columns on a table, you may create new column as a result of computation. If you want the current age of employees, we get the birth date of each employee and deduct it from the current year. If the current year on our example is 2014, by simply the getting the birth year of the employee using the year function and deducting it from 2014, 
we derive age. You may also filter those employees who has an age below 20 and see already which records are faulty in coding of birth dates. Assume that the company requires you to leave last name, first name, job, salary, the 10% increase on the salary, and the new salary is the added 10%. Your script will look like this. Thanks for watching. If you like to see the script of the video presented, please click the link below. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share it with your friends. Buy the book for more challenging exercises with solutions. Visit our Facebook and Twitter account. Bye!